Veronica Anna Rosa. We are here in my studio in Lisbon. I'm artist, mainly we working with flowers. I come from Poland, from Warsaw, city centre, and I moved here to Lisbon seven years ago. My grandparents were biochemists, so every summer I was going to visit them. Uh, it was more countryside. And I used to make herbium with my grandpa, who, who taught me all the Latin names and uh, the char characteristic of the plants we were collecting. And also I remember I loved to go with him to laboratories to get a look through microscope and to discover a completely different reality which is invisible to the naked eye. First I started with beautiful flowers to me, but then uh, I started to search an obvious beauty and something which is raw, which is not common, not popular. So in my recent series I worked with endemic flowers uh, from the places I've never been to. So there is one from Brazil, one from Costa Rica, one from Japan, another one from uh, Iran, this one actually, <laughs> I'm working on. Um, and those flowers are protected by law, so they can't go outside of the country of their origin, are only present in those countries. And uh, each of these flowers has its own story to tell, and it's actually the storytelling behind the plants which interests me the most. Gloriosa is a popular flower in Indonesia and actually the seeds of this flower are um, used to eliminate the people that we don't really like. And there were a lot of cases where especially the mother-in-law were eliminated the new, <laughs> new brides, <laughs> new wives of the sun by the infusion from the seed of this flower. So this one, it's duality and it represents a special anthurium endemic to Costa Rica. And duality because actually it's a um, bisexual flower. It has female and male parts and in botany, flowers of those kinds are called perfect. I discovered these flowers less or more on the same time that I was reading uh, Virginia Woolf and she was discussing this uh, complexity of two sexes in the same body. But on the other side you have uh, Cataleya lobata, it's an endemic orchid from Brazil, close to Rio. It's a really uh, beautiful flower with enormous uh, petals and something which is called in orchids lips. But the story behind is quite, um, quite sad because this flower is on the extinction because of the exp uh, exploitation of the rainforest and also climate changes uh, in this territory. It's conscious or unconscious, but there is this connection, really strong uh, connection with my grandparents and my work and how I look into the world today. Mm -hmm.